Hey guys, it's Brian Taylor with Dreamline Realty. Today we're going on tour to the Abington neighborhood in Harrisburg, North Carolina. So buckle up and let's get rolling. So today we're gonna take a tour of the neighborhood of Abington in Harrisburg, North Carolina. And Abington essentially sits on the corner of Robinson Church Road and Rocky River Road. And this is the entrance way from that side. So there are two entrances into this neighborhood and I'll show you the other one off of the Hickory Ridge Road in just a moment. So Abington started construction in this neighborhood about 2004. And at that time, there was about three or four custom home builders that were in the neighborhood. So you'd essentially go into the model home, pick what builder you wanted to build with, and you would, you would actually design your own floor plan with that custom builder, and then they would get your house started. So the good thing about Abington that a lot of people like is there's just a lot of mature trees, wide streets, and this section of Abington that I'm showing you right now is the custom home section. And you'll notice that almost every house in this section is full brick, three car garages, just some really awesome designs to these houses because they were custom. And if you take a look at this new construction house up here on the left, that's one of the remaining lots in here and that's a basement lot. That lot was there for a long, long time, but because of the the slope of that lot, they had to do some work on that on that land to get that buildable. But that house is probably gonna close about 800 to 850,000. So I'm gonna take a left on this street here and I'll show you some of the other houses that were in this custom home section. So in 2010, when the market crashed, the community kind of just went stagnant for a while till everybody figured things out. Then the back side of the neighborhood and all of those lots back there were picked up by a couple of other builders. It's pretty much the same size houses, but a little bit different design. And a lot of those are not full brick, but a lot of them do have brick front. So you can see coming down this street, just the designs of these houses are really unique. And Abington is just one of those neighborhoods in Harrisburg that is really desirable. And it's desirable because it is only a few minutes from downtown Harrisburg. It's only five minutes from 485. It's got that mature neighborhood feel. And you're really close to the schools. So Hickory Ridge Middle, Hickory Ridge High School, and Harrisburg Elementary School are just down the neighborhood about a half a mile. And then the new Harrisburg, or the Hickory Ridge Elementary School is just up the street uh, to the right about a mile. So coming down this street, you can, you can just see three car garages, a lot of space between houses, which is really appealing for this neighborhood. You can't find the space between these houses and new construction anymore. Just these builders just want to pack them on top of each other. So this is just one of those neighborhoods where you have that space and just some gorgeous, gorgeous ex exteriors on these houses. There's about 320 houses in Abington. And as I take you up this street, we'll make a left at the roundabout and I'll take you on to the, what I would say the newer side of Abington is. Everything on that side is, is all sold out. It's been sold out for a couple of years, but those were the houses that were picked up in 2010 and a little bit after that by Ryan Holmes. They built a lot of the stuff that I'm gonna show you. There was a couple other smaller builders that picked up some lots on this other side as well. But Ryan Holmes, for the most part, had the majority of those lots. So the square footage of a lot of these houses in Abington as a whole are gonna go anywhere from 2,500 square feet all the way up to 6,000 square feet, especially for those basement lots. So this is about the section where Ryan Holmes picked up the remaining home sites. And you'll notice some differences. You still have the size of the properties, but a lot of these houses are gonna have a brick front with hardy board siding or a brick front with vinyl siding. A lot of them still have the three car garages. And as of this recording in June of 2021, 
The properties on this side of the neighborhood are selling for 500 or over 500. In fact, there was a property on this street a couple of months ago that went on the market for 450,000 and it sold for 500,000. And I tell you that because in the market that we're in right now, people are willing to pay a premium to be in Abington. And as I'm recording this right now, there is not one house that is currently for sale at the moment. There are four or five houses that are under contract, but nothing is currently on the market. Things in Abington have been selling for over asking price and only in a couple of days, which essentially is the same story across all of the Charlotte area and across all the country as well. So just a high demand neighborhood and I think as you see the tour that we're on, you can see why this neighborhood is so appealing. There's a lot of kids in this neighborhood, which is a really great thing. If you have kids, you want their kids to meet folks. If you're moving here from out of state or whatever the case may be, a lot of activity that happens in this neighborhood. And as I take you farther on the tour, I will show you the clubhouse and the pool and the tennis courts. But as we make our way outside of the neighborhood on this side, we will approach Hickory Ridge Road. And as I mentioned, to the left are the high school and middle school and the elementary school. And to the right, about a mile, is the new Hickory Ridge Elementary School. So with the growth in Harrisburg over the last several years, they had to come in and build another elementary school to keep up with the, with the population. So as we make our way back towards the middle of the neighborhood, right really central in the middle of that neighborhood is where the amenities center is. So I mentioned Her or Abington is only about five minutes at the most to get to 485. And there's just so much growth that has happened around the Harrisburg area. On your way up to get to 485, there's an emergency room in town there's four or five different pharmacies there's four or five different grocery stores you're only 10 minutes from the concord mills mall and you're only about 25 minutes from uptown charlotte so it's just so close to everything and the growth around this whole area it just continues to to expand so as far as an investment opportunity this neighborhood is just top notch and that's one of the reasons why it's so desirable. A lot of these houses were built with in-ground irrigation, so a lot of folks enjoy that. A lot of builders don't do that anymore, so that's why you're seeing a lot of these green lawns because people are using that irrigation to obviously keep their lawns up. This summer heat in, in North Carolina can really, really damage the grass. A lot of these properties that you're looking at right now are fescue lawns and without a ton of water, those lawns can get brown pretty quickly. A lot of the new construction has converted uh, to Bermuda grass because it tolerates the heat a lot better. And as we come around the cul-de-sac, or the, the roundabout right here, on the left-hand side is where you'll see the amenity center. So there is a full clubhouse, with a, a kitchen inside there. You can rent the clubhouse out for events and it's, it's really nice. And behind that clubhouse, as you can see right here to the left, is the Olympic size swimming pool. And one of the neat things about this neighborhood and other neighborhoods in the area is in the summertime, these neighborhoods will form swim teams for the kids. So if you're age five through 18, I believe it is, you can join the community swim team and you can compete against other neighborhoods once or twice a week they have these swim meets and it looks like they're getting ready to have a swim meet tonight because they had the banners up and all of that good stuff like that and they call themselves the abington alligators and you can see the playground and the tennis court just off to the left there so as we leave the clubhouse i just want to take you on a couple other streets in this custom home section of abington and this neighborhood is, like I said, completely built out with the exception of these two houses that are being built here. There may be one or two other basement lots that would be available, but they would need some work to get those buildable. And uh, these guys here, like I said, are probably gonna close 850 
maybe even 900. It wouldn't be surprising to me if they closed at 900, especially in the market that we're in now. But as we make our way around this cul-de-sac, just want to give you a, a couple other views of a couple other streets. So you have essentially the majority of the neighborhood captured here for you. And again, most of these houses that we're looking at here were built in that 2006 to 2009 time frame. And the majority of these houses probably sold for 450 to 475. And right now, these houses that are going up for sale, and you'll see a couple of them on this street, probably will end up selling for over 600,000. But again, you can just see the, the space between the homes. A, a lot of these lots in Abington are gonna be 0.35 to a half an acre. So again, you just can't find this in neighborhoods anymore. These builders nowadays just wanna build as many houses as close to each other as they can. And it's tough to find the room between the houses that you're seeing here in Abington. But I appreciate you coming on the tour with me today as we get ready to wrap this up. If you have any other neighborhoods that you would like a tour of, just drop those in the comments. We'd be happy to go out and take a tour of that neighborhood for you. Or if you have any questions at all about Abington or any neighborhoods in the Charlotte area, just reach out to us directly. Our cell phone number is 704-968-3105. And we'd be happy to get those questions answered for you. And if we could do anything to help you out, if you're thinking about moving to the area, we would be honored to be a resource for you. So again, there's a, a lot there at the end. It looks like that one is not even for sale. That's probably some common area space. But again, I just love the exteriors of this, of this neighborhood and the, and the wide streets. Just everything about it is appealing. So as we come up to this stop sign, we'll take a right and I'm gonna take you on to the very last phase of construction that happened in Abington. And these properties I'll show you in a minute, really were built between 2015 to 2019. And uh, they were built by another builder that picked up the remaining lots when they opened up this last section. It's very similar to the Ryan home section that I showed you previously. A little bit different look. You won't see any, any full brick. You'll see hardy board siding on most of these properties. You might see a brick front here and there. But yeah, so there we go. So those are the remaining build, uh, remaining homes that were built in here. And if you were to take a left here, you would go into a cul-de-sac. But we'll take a right. And the, the houses that you're seeing now, Rocky River Road backs up behind those houses. So these ones are fairly close to the highway. And as we come to this intersection, if you were to go straight, that would be some more of the beginning custom homes that were built in Abington. But for the sake of the video timing, I, I didn't take you down that way, but you can get the idea of, of kind of the same type of home that you would see. So that is essentially our tour. And as we make our left here, we will exit back out of Abington on the Rocky River Road entrance. And once again, hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see other tours, just let us know and we'll see you next time. Hope you have a great day. Take care.